guys, Trouble here today, and welcome back to Banished! Uh, so, today we are gonna work on growing the population. I'm also going to actually unassign my physician, because someone mentioned in the comments it's a good idea to have a hospital built but not have anyone working in there, because they're not really gonna do anything unless there's like an outbreak of some disease. Uh, and they, they mentioned it's a good idea to just have the hospital ready, uh, ready to go, and then just sort of apply them. Uh, get the sort of physician in there later if you need someone to treat people. So we will do that. Uh, I'm just gonna... Uh, can I just get the... I don't want the symbol there. Can the symbol just go away? No, I'll just turn it off, whatever. Uh, <laughs> so what I want to do this episode, we should probably get on... Get a rig on and start building some other things. Such as the... Uh, town hall, wherever that is. There, that one. That would be good. I don't know if we really need that yet. Maybe the trade ship might be a good idea so we can get some more types of uh, crop to grow. I don't know, because everything else seems to be pretty good. We finally got a herbalist in. I finally remembered that I needed to do that. Um, what? So, food. Where do I find the trader dude again? See in here? That's a well. Food? Oh, yeah, that one. Trading post. No, not that. I want the... Uh, no. No, maybe... Is it a trading post? Yeah, it is. That just goes in the water. That's right. No, I don't know. For some reason, I thought it wasn't that. So, that'll go... I presume it comes down this river, because they, they come down a river. I presume it's this one. Can I... We can put it here. Right there. How about that? So, we'll get that underway. Uh, we've got two builders, so they'll eventually come and do that. How are we going with resources? It's also suggested that per 100 citizens, we should have about 10 laborers spare. Uh, so, you know, for every 10 citizens, one laborer, we should have, uh, additional, just so that, you know, the whole, uh, town remains efficient and everything sort of gets done and we don't have to sit around waiting, uh, for more laborers or anything like that. So, we'll work on that, getting that sort of golden ratio going too. Um, I'm wondering, I might get another, I was thinking I might get another barn here or something. Just so when we do trade that they can go right there. I don't know, because you can trade animals and all that kind of stuff as well. We should probably get a pasture. I don't know. I don't think another barn's really necessary, is it? Probably not. Why don't we go? Well, why don't we just wait till that's built and then we'll go from there? Because I, I don't really, I, I don't really know what I'm doing. Obviously, so let's figure it out once we get that up. Uh, you guys are both at your limits. That is fine by me. By me. Uh, amount of sword and medicine. We have a little bit of medicine. Plenty of clothes. Stone. We have plenty of iron now. We're slowly gathering stone because I think they're wandering out into the bush to gather it all from over here. Uh, and eventually when we need to, we'll get a mine. But I'm not going to rush into that. We've got a load of stone over there as well. So we can eventually like build some bridges to get over there. <sighs> How's this going? So absolutely nothing is on that yet. Uh, I will actually raise the priority of that because they're probably... Um, Working on something else first. So just a little bit of that. There you go, guys. A child was born. Is anyone living in that house yet? Oh, they are. Okay, so that's good. It was just that one that was empty, right? A few single single people. I may get... I might as well just fill it in with houses. Plan them out. Uh, I might actually put some more down over here, though. In the town area. Now, I think I want to... Put them over here, maybe. Because I want... Actually, I want to leave quite a bit of space around here. I might put that over here. Maybe... So I, I would, <laughs> what I'm thinking is I want to leave space for, first of all, like farms maybe down here and like a pasture around there. Um, because that would just help us out a little bit. Now, another woodcutter. Did we get another woodcutter up there? Because that would probably be a good idea. Just so there's one at this side of the town as well. Maybe we'll start growing a little township over here actually. So why don't we go before I build more houses. Uh, actually, you know what? No, let's not worry about that. Let's not get ahead of ourselves because I really am getting ahead of myself right now. Um, <laughs> I just need people to build stuff, essentially. Uh, because we don't have any laborers to work at these new places I'm building. So, if anything, we should just build houses. Um, can one fit in there? No, it annoyingly cannot. Alright. Well, we're gonna put a house there, there, and there. Oh, are you serious? That's too hilly. That's gonna have to go there, then. That's annoying. Uh, i go there. And then it will go there. It can't go there because then I can't walk through. I have to go there. And then there. I'm hoping that this staggered look looks okay when it's all put together. It might look awful, but we'll see. <laughs> see if it looks any good. Uh, reserve of logs is low. Reserve of firewood is also low. Not good, but we are in late winter, so it should be okay. Uh, 
But yeah, we should definitely work on getting more houses so we can get some more people. Let's get all those pathways in. Uh, doing beans and beans. I guess we should... Let's mix it up, go for squash. Now, if you guys could actually, uh, build this, that'd be great. So iron, we have plenty of iron, I just haven't delivered it yet. We also have plenty of stone, there's enough to do it. They just need to deliver it on time. Uh, yeah, you guys are starting to get cold. That is not good. At all. But, it's early spring, so it should be okay. Yeah, that, that was a close call. We could definitely use some more trees. Maybe if we get them to cut down these ones over here. But I want them to build... Uh, always trying to find... I gotta say, the uh, the menu system in this game is not ideal. <laughs> I mean, yes, eventually I get used to it again, and, I, and then it's fine, but... Trying to find stuff is often quite annoying. Now, I wish I had not kept following this stupid layout I've done. I might move that where that pathway is, because... It's annoying that I can't put houses out, I might move, shift the pathway over one. Uh, eventually. <laughs> so it can fit... Because otherwise we've got these big gaps everywhere that we can't put anything in. Alright, so that's finally being built. You guys are getting a little bit cold. You guys again. Classic you guys. That is something you would do, isn't it? <laughs> um, as for the Forest Head Lodge. So we have... Uh, two or four Forest Heads working there. So I presume if we got more Forest Heads, we would... get more logs, right? That's probably how that works, I would imagine. Especially because if we're going to be getting to spring soonish, then that might be something we want to consider. All right, let's put on. Let me go more foresters. And do that instead. So we've got six foresters. So we have three foresters in each cabin. Oh, I don't know, whatever you call it. Uh, died of old age. Oh, damn it. <laughs> um, that's annoying. But, oh well. So this is almost built eventually, if you guys could get that done. We only have three builders, so to be fair, to be fair, we've only got three builders, so you know. It's hard work. Let's go ahead and get the Forester's Lodge to go ahead and remove that. Let me just, sorry, I'm just closing my email client, because I, I, I just know, because I forgot to close it. I just know it's going to go off in the video if I don't close it now. Alright, uh, no, I didn't want to do that. I want to go remove, I'm going to remove these trees here, because they're all just close by. So we might as well. To there. Now, yeah, we didn't want to build houses any further there. Building down this way is fine, it's just... Don't want to go there, because there's um, something else in the way. Alright, so they'll start cutting those down. Okay, cool, that's also done. Uh, we've got three spare laborers. How many traders do we need? Six. Probably don't actually need that many. But... Uh, we want to start putting some stuff in here that we can trade, really. Um, I've got to remember how this works. You put... Oh, so... Sort by... So yeah, this is the inventory, so we can store stuff in here to trade. So why don't we get... Because coats trade quite well, I think. Why don't we get some coats in there? Because we don't seem to be having a shortage of those. Oh, that's a lot of coats. Let's get 20 coats in there. So let's get some tools in there, because we see... Oh, actually, no, I don't want to run out of iron too quickly. Uh, we can do... We can definitely do food. Um, why don't we go... Actually... How much herbs do we have? Not that much. Why don't we go for... I don't actually know how much, like, potato and stuff we have. We're not growing potatoes, how could I put it in there? I guess this is stuff I don't have. Well, what do I have? Hmm. Also, yeah, I should probably assign some, uh... Traders. Go two traders. So they will start... I think they start moving the stuff in there. So why don't we go... We have a lot of food. Well, what food do I have? Hang on, let's have a look. So we have... Not a lot of stuff in there. It must be in one of the other ones. We have quite a lot of stuff in here. So we've got a lot of onions, a lot of venison, we got a lot of venison, and a lot of roots. So why don't we go onions and venison, we'll put some of that in the trade post. Be, yeah, so we've got 20 coats in there. Uh, let's go get a little bit of venison and let's go 300. And then, uh, maybe, what was the other one? Onions? So they are. Go... 200 of those. Alright, so then some dude should eventually come along. So that's what we've got. That's the value of them. Uh, so the value, each coat is worth 15. Each piece of venison is worth 3. Onions are only worth 1. But when the dude comes along, we should be able to uh, auto-purchase never. Oh, okay, yeah, so then we... This is what I would like to purchase. Is it? I don't know. I really want to buy seeds, though. I can't remember how you do that. I think he comes along. 
Do I just select it out of here? I don't know. Oh, okay. Why do you keep clicking over there? Hmm. How's everyone doing? You're getting cold. Yeah, we get, we need more firewood. <laughs> Definitely. Uh, fruits. I don't want... Where do I find... Why don't I just wait till this dude arrives? Because he'll just arrive, won't he? Unless it's been changed, but I don't think it has been. I think I've just forgotten how it works. Uh, <laughs> I think I've completely forgotten. Uh, so we've got a bunch of empty houses. Some people have moved in, which is nice. Alright, I've got three builders. I'll just chuck them into laboring. I will put some more on forestry, though, because I do want that to, to really amp up and get some more trees. Uh, yeah, getting a lot of cold people there. I think what we should do... Uh... So the forest is large. We have one there. Maybe if we go... We have one over there. It's not really good. The next good place is really over here. It's quite far away, though. I guess we can do one here-ish. That'd be fine, this sort of area. Like that. Um, let's go there. And then this can go... I don't think it can go over that, though. It has to go around. Oh, that's annoying. Serious? They can walk over it though, which is actually quite annoying. Can I build a tunnel through it? Damn it. Why can't they- that's not- why can't I build a pathway over that? That's not even steep. That annoys me. That just annoys me. Alright, let's go for, uh... What do I want? Stockpile, I think, next to that. Stockpile. Stockpile. There you go. Let me get a little pathway. And then, what if we go the pathway this way? I like that. Not ideal, but it'll, it'll do. Uh, we could probably get some other stuff out here too. Why don't we go for, um, like another gatherer's hut or something for food? Because where's the other one over there? This might be good. If we put it here, and then we can build a bridge, and I'll also go over that way. Maybe a hunting cabin. Why don't we go a hunting cabin? There's quite a few animals around here. Why don't we go put it there, actually? Hmm. No, let's put it, let's put it here. Like that. Then, reserve of firewood is low. Yes, I am aware of that. A lot of people getting cold. Um. Oh, yeah, well, you've warmed up. That's good. Then we're going to go for a bridge over to here. Eventually. They'll build it. I... <laughs> It's always dumb how animals just go straight through the water. Now, is this, um, this trader dude ever gonna, like, show up, or do I have to actually put in something? I really can't remember how this works, so I apologize if you're yelling at your screen right now, but I cannot remember. Fuel. Like, what the hell is fuel? What do I even need fuel for? Tools, clothes, meats, grains. Fruits, vegetables. But I want, like, seeds to do more farming, right? Hmm. Maybe I need a town hall. I don't know. I can't remember how this works. <laughs> I have no clue. Alright, so, um, Forrester. I'm gonna go chuck one more dude on that. So we have three people there. We have three people there. And I guess three people over here as well, right? We have nine. Yeah, so that's good. We've got three on each. So that should actually be quite good. Um, now, the bottleneck at this point might not even be... Yeah, I think at the bottleneck at this point is just that we don't have enough woodcutters because we only have got one. So let's get another one. Let's go for one up here because probably what's happening is one of the dudes is walking all the way up here to get the logs because his thing is down over there. So he's probably running across the city to get it. And it's probably bottlenecking uh, the way that we are producing logs, which is not great. Now, that's going there. So that's there. That circle's there. Now, we don't really want to build past that, so we can do like a single line of houses down there or something, I don't know. But that's where that'll go. Now, how many hunters do we have? Because we've only got one there. Uh, hunter, four of nine, so we could definitely do with more. Now oh, we've got another laborer anyways. But I really want to make sure we still have all the spare laborers. Storage barn would be good. Get that over here. Oh, we got a, uh, a trader. That's what that little symbol is. Okay, so let's... Um, can I just, like, pause or something while I do this? Uh, custom order, purchase, trade. So he's got sheep, so I could get sheep and make wool. 
They cost 600. And I think I need two of them, wouldn't I? So if I wanted two... Yeah, so this is how this works. But I don't think I want sheep, not yet. Oh, do I? Hey, no, not yet. Let's not worry about that. Go away. I don't care about you. I'll dis I'll let you go. There you go. You can be dismissed. I don't want you. Um, yeah, bugger off. Uh, <laughs> leave me alone, dude. Okay, so... Yeah, everyone can just happily walk over this slight hill, but I can't build a pathway over it. Oh no, that'd be too easy. Oh no, the teacher died. That's sad. Uh, what I want to do is move where this pathway goes so we can get some houses in here. So that'll go there. Then we need to remove that. I don't even know if this is counting as removing the pathway. I can't tell. How do you remove a pathway? Uh, I don't know. Let's see. If reserve of firewood is low. I'm aware. But we're, we're working on that. Did I... Is the other one built yet? No. Because we, we have a lot of stuff that needs to be built, but we don't have a lot of builders. Um, plenty of food and all that, but everyone's getting cold, which... It's <laughs> currently the main issue. Oh, the bridge is built. Look at that. Didn't actually want that built. Now, how do we get rid of the pathway? Is that... Oh, remove roads. There's a special button for it. Look at that. There. And... There. And... And then we'll put houses in there, basically, is the idea. I guess I didn't really need to do that bit. That was unnecessary. Okay. Reserve of firewood is low. Yes, yes it is. But once this is built, which I guess I really should have prioritized, uh, <laughs> click through every single menu until I find the one I actually want. There we go. Health and um, happiness is good, though. Four and a half on both. So I'm quite happy with that. Firewood is... Yeah, everyone is getting quite cold at this point. Mmm, that is, that is bad. That is bad. We could collect some stone over there, too. Now... Okay, so... Is that built yet? They at least got the resources on it, they're bringing it. There's, I mean, we've got a ton of stuff right there. You can just bring it from right next door. Like, there's loads of stone coming. Just, just, bloop! Bloop! Yeah, I don't want to put it on there. At least no one's died yet, but people are very cold. <laughs> Like, every single house is like, oh, oh, It's too cold. Okay, six of eight stone. How about eight of eight stone? Yeah, you, you really, you're really having a laugh now, guys. You're really, really having a laugh. Let's get three builders. Now, if you could, uh... Okay, so you, you waited until it wasn't snowing. <laughs> All that time. I mean, really? Oh, look at those trees just bloomed. That's beautiful. Now... You still haven't put the stone there, I, I, I've noticed. Whilst there is stone literally next door. Um, so if I could just get you to work on that. That'd be fantastic. You've even just put more stone there. You could have dropped it off on the way. <laughs> oh my god, what are you doing? Continue! Oh, the humanity, where are you guys? One is over there, one is over there, and one is over there. Oh, here you go, this guy's bringing- There you go, he's finally brought the bloody stone there, but now he's buggered off somewhere else. Ah, <sighs> died of old age. Don't die of old age. Now I've got no spare laborers. Okay, here we go. They probably built all the other stuff first. I don't even know what we were building, what other stuff we were building. I know there was a barn somewhere. Alright, so let's go... Where is woodcutter? <laughs> I'm trying to find it. There it is. So we get two woodcutters. And uh, might get a second herbalist. I don't think we really need to though, actually. It might be unnecessary, but whatever. Get them on the job. Oh, we got, oh we've got a whole bunch of laborers now. Good. Let's go... Uh, well, what do we... we? Let's just get more uh, foresters because... The current crisis is the lack of wood. So let's get those maxed out. Get as much ha help, helping hands as we can. That's what I was trying to say. Uh, so we get the the logs, you know, a lot more logs. Has been okay. We've been killed by a falling tree. Well, there you go. It might have been his first day on the job too. Who knows? Okay, so we got a, we got three spare people. Let's go ahead and uh, stack up some new. Ha well, how much stone do we have? We have quite a lot of stone at this point, so we might actually start building. So it's well, oh, that's forty stone in a house. Though. That's a lot. No, let's not waste the stone yet. Let's get two houses facing that way. The one there. I uh, can't fit one in there, though. Uh, it looks interesting with all the houses kind of, like, placed weirdly. 
I guess. Can any of these fit along there? No, two. Oh, we can put one there. Become a student. Good, I guess. No, nope. right there. And I'm going to go a little pathway like that. There you go. So those houses will go in there. Uh, let me chuck a few builders on that. I'll keep a spare labor in case someone dies, and then we're good to go. So they they happily take all the resources there. Now, how are we going with the uh, Firewood. Firewood is starting to pick up a little bit, and it's gone. But we do have a lot of logs, so now the issue is just getting more woodcutters. We might get one, um... We got, so this dude should hopefully just be taking from the local... There's not a lot of stuff here, though. I don't know. A lot of trees, though. That's good. We might get another woodcutter over here, or maybe just one over here. Because there are some logs over there as well. Might do that. But we'll, we'll wait till we have a few more laborers before we sort of dive into that. We've got a bunch of houses, which is nice. Uh, probably going to need to up food production, though. Um, maybe we should see if we can get a, uh, a herdsman to have a little paddock. That'd be good. All right, so we've got no spare people now. Everyone's busy. I'm going to deassign you. There's only one house build left anyways. There you go. All right, so if we go for a... Pasture, it's actually what it's called on a paddock. Put it here. That's not a good spot. Let's go maybe back here where there's a little bit more space. Let's go. I don't know how big these should be. Let's go 15 by 15. So let's get that. Whoa, 56 logs for that. Alright. Get one builder on that. Uh, reserve of firewood is low. Yes, it probably is. That's usually the way it goes. Unfortunately, that seems to happen all of the time. Now, I'm hoping we actually have some animals to put in here. I don't know, but we'll see. So... Teachers, fine. There's a lot of open jobs, but that's okay. Uh, we should be getting a lot of new, uh, lot of new laborers in the next few years because we've got so many new houses. We might actually have overdone it. I'm not going to build any more new houses for a while, I think, because we're getting a lot of new people born, which means we definitely need more food. Because uh, we're down to like 3,600 food. We used to be around 5,000. I mean, it's not really a problem now, but if it keeps, if we keep letting it slip like that, then it becomes a problem. So, yeah, let's, um, let's make sure we have enough food. <laughs> but, um, I mean, the first thing to do is make sure we have enough firewood, and we are just keeping up with the firewood demand. Just. It seems to be going down and then popping back up just in time. Firewood is low, yeah, then it pops back up to 30. It seems to just make it. Okay, let me uh, slow down time here. What can we do and how does this work? So we need to go... Uh, I don't know how to do this. Let me, first of all, let me assign a, a dude. I think we need to get something from a trader. I feel like there's like animals everywhere. Can I just use those? Um, where are herdsmen? Uh... How do I do this? One. Zero. One. And I said so I could have someone work there, but I can't... Yeah, I can't select any type of animal yet. Alright, so that's completely useless. We need to wait for a trader and get animals from that. Okay, well... I mean... We tried. Uh, what should we do? Should we get... Um, let's change these up for next year, back to beans. There you go. Uh, and then, why don't we go for... Got a hunting camp. Actually, how many people are working on the hunting cabins and all that? Not that many. Why don't we just get two more people on those? Because that will just help us produce more food. What we should also do is get another... Woodcutter. Let's just get one in town. No, but there's no, there's no forest. There's no, like, logs nearby, though. There's a whole stack of logs up here. Why don't we just get a second one here? Like that. There you go. Uh, we've got no builders. Right, let me uh, take them off hunting. Because <laughs> I'm going to need your help for, for building. There you go. Alright, let's get on that, boys. There we go. Get that underway. Now, that did actually encroach in that little circle a bit. Which is my bad. That one's fine. That should be okay, though, I guess. Uh, we haven't seen... A, we've only seen one trader. I mean, I guess maybe they come once a year or something. I don't know. But hopefully we find... Uh, well, hopefully we get something good next time. Okay, now if you could... Oh, yeah, wow, you did this way quicker this time. I was gonna say, if you could get the stone in there a little bit quicker, that'd be great. There we go, alright. Oops, sorry, didn't mean to do that. Um, 
woodcutter. Let's get a third one on that. We've got a lot of cold people around here. Not good. Not good. Okay. Reserve of firewood is low. Yep. Yep. No, I understand. I can, I can recognize. Uh, let's go for a farm. Oh, I'll actually go for another little fishing thing. Oh, hang on. Speak of the devil. Here he is. Oh, he's got cattle. Can I afford two of those? How much is 20 coats? Probably not enough. 300. <laughs> okay, well, and how come I can't, he do, doesn't want that or something? Is that why? Um, well, what do you want? And what's worth a lot, really, is my other question. Uh, what if we do 50 tools? They're, they're only worth eight, though. That's not really, and they take a while to make. Well, we just get more. Well, how many coats would it take? So, how much are coats worth? 15. All right. I remember this from the old days. We'd open the calculator and figure it out. So, it was, um, well, 1600, and each coat is worth 15. So, we need 106 coats. Oh, damn it. Well, okay, 107. I need 107 coats. Let's go, boys. Get that underway. You know, can, if you could stick around for a little while, that'd be good. What else would be worth a bit? How much is venison worth? Well, he doesn't want venison, though. I presume that's what it means. Yeah, items not available for trade. Oh, they're just not in there. No, there's 300 items in there. They just don't want it. Um, let's get more traders just to help out there. Let's see. I don't know how long he stays there for. Probably not long enough. Now, I want two of those. Count, we have 70. It's not enough though. 71. We gotta, we gotta make the coats. We have no coats left. Uh, well, we can at least buy one cow. And then we can get milk. But I want two so they can breed. Oh, but cows don't breed anyway. You need, you need a bull. How's that supposed to work? Maybe if I just buy one, it will work. I don't know how the breeding system works in this game. But if this guy could just hang, hang tight. So I get more coats. There we go. <laughs> Please don't leave. I don't know how long he stays here for. Maybe if I have the window open, he won't leave. There we go. Come on. Come on, Taylor. Tail like your life depends on it. Tail like you've never tailed before. We're also running low on food. Uh, well, not low. We've got like 2,400, but still not good. Where are my coats? There they are. Still not enough, though. Need 106. Come on. Give me some coats. Give me some coats, damn you. At least we have enough stuff to make coats, so that's something. Um, the firewood is low. Yes, I'm aware. Now, if you could just hang out for a second, dude, you're going to get so many coats. You're not, you're not going to even know what to do with all these coats. Uh, here we go. Here's another little delivery. Almost there. He's going to leave, isn't he? He's going to leave before I can deliver all the coats. 102. So close. All right, come on. Just need 106. I think it's actually 107 because 106 points something, I think it was. Come on. 104, that's not enough. 1560. Damn it! <gasps> more coats, yes! 106! Need one more. 107! Yeah, trade! Okay, now, slow down time because I also don't want 107 coats in there. Oh, no, jeez, go back to 20. It's really unnecessary to have that many coats in there, so let's make sure they don't keep bringing them over. Now, uh, yeah, you may leave. Trader, you can go away. Oop, we'll have one trader. Uh, get cattle in that farm. No, pasture, sorry. Uh, we're gonna go herdsman. Two of those. So they will take them over there. Uh, so they can have a maximum of 11 in there. We'll probably build some more pastures later on. We can even, maybe even move that one, I don't know. Okay, so... We've got a few new laborers as well. Um, food was becoming a problem. That's what was becoming a problem. So let's get some more people on hunting. Maybe one more gathering because I don't have enough people left over. There you go. Off they go. But we should start getting milk and all that kind of stuff from the cows. So that'll be good. Oh, and someone died. Fantastic. 
Not really, because now I have no one spare. Let's reduce a the gatherer. There you go. Any 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 produce yet? No. No, no produce. Come on, come on, cows. Come on. Give me some milk. Where's my milk at? There's no milk. Well, alright. That's rude. I wonder when we should get a uh I should get a, a like a graveyard thing, like a chapel or whatever it is. Do we even need that? Is that like something that you need? I can't remember why you need that. I know it's something you could do, but do I need it? And as if we couldn't have just captured all these animals. Like look at them, they're just we're walking through the fence. Gotta bred them. Nine coats. Alright. Well, whatever. Okay, so we have no spare uh, people right now, which is not good. Uh, we'll take it off of foresters, I guess. Uh, yeah, we, we've we've definitely caught up with the, the firewood fiasco of last year, or whenever it was. I don't know. But, we need to uh, catch up with the food fiasco. If we continue at this rate, we're not going to have enough food for everyone. Have you made me anything yet? No. Yeah, so basically 11 is the ones to keep in there, and then any that are bred after 11 are the ones that are slaughtered for food. So, but they still produce milk, which I presume counts as food. I don't know, but I'm going to leave this part here. Uh, comments and suggestions and tips and tricks in the section down below. Uh, but thanks so much, you guys. I'll see you next time, and have an awesome day.